biking over to the beast practice right now to get some footage of this workout. Um, I think I would address some of the comments from the last video. I asked you guys if you want to, we want to hear from me. A lot of people, uh, you know, were asking about if I have a job. I do have a job. I graduated from the College of the Holy Cross in 2019. Uh, dodge all that COVID stuff, which was nice. Uh, Got to have all my four years actually in school. I majored in biology and religious studies. Kind of an odd combo, but you know, I enjoyed it. Graduated 2019 in May, got a job that started in July of 2019 in DC, uh, technically Arlington, as a biologist, doing some work for the EPA. I mean, I like it. Working from home here allows me to be a little bit flexible on my lunch breaks. I can come out and, and film stuff and then I'll just uh, work through lunch and maybe work a little bit later in the afternoon to make sure that I get all my hours in and all that. We'll see where life takes me now, but for now I'm a biologist. I made it to practice, but I forgot a helmet, so hopefully I don't crash and die. And if you don't know, don't know, don't know. All right guys, I'm like three minutes into biking to film for these guys and my hands are frozen. Not bringing gloves might have been a fatal mistake. So basically what I'm doing is I have my Garmin going run on the bike every mile or so or when I think there might be a cool spot. I'll pull over and get a shot of them uh, running. Allie and Allie V are coming up. I'll get a shot of them too. Make sure you check out Allie's channel as well. I'm getting footage for her too. Major the flip. Hands are still intact, but it's getting pretty dire. Hopefully the wind will be the other way and won't feel as bad on the way back. Whew, made it home and didn't crash. Thank God I didn't have a helmet. Now it's time for lunch. Make some fried rice. We'll figure it out. But uh, stay tuned to see what I eat for lunch. Mm. That's gonna be delicious. No, not that interesting of a food, but it's gonna be tasty. Let's see how this tastes. Pretty good, like a four out of 10. Just uh, rolling out a little bit before I go on this run. Probably gonna do a workout with Jake tomorrow. Hopefully it's fun. We'll see how it goes. So we're back from a run. Ran like eight miles, like 620 space. For the Strava here. Um, make sure you follow me on Strava. Um, a lot of people in the comments on my Strava have been asking me if I have any running goals, and I do. Um, I'm lucky enough to be out here at altitude, so I figured I might as well also train to run something fast. I didn't run very fast in college. You can look me up on Tiffers. It's not very good. Um, when we were up at Boulder, I ran a 32 and 944 at 5,300 feet, which converts to about a 930. Um, I didn't feel too beat after it. Definitely thought I could have gone faster. Spencer kept gassing me up and telling me I could have gone a lot faster, so did Ari. But my goal now is I wanna try and break 15 in the 5K when uh, we get back down to sea level. So definitely gonna be trying to put in the work while we're uh, out here, take advantage of the altitude. So stay tuned, because uh, I'm definitely gonna be throwing in some training. Some friends from home are, are here as well, living with us, so hopefully I can get some, uh, some working with them. But if you wanna follow the journey, definitely check out Strava. What's up everyone, it's the next day. I've gotten some requests, mostly just from my mom of a house tour from our house, so. Check out the house we're staying in. So this is the uh, front area. Jake is sleeping on the couch because there's only three bedrooms. This is kind of where we uh, roll out and stretch over here. Dining room table. Song, I only the boys, the kitchen, pretty nice kitchen, you gotta say. Not too bad, not too bad. And here is a uh, laundry room and the bathroom. And then we go upstairs. A lot of pretty weird artwork in here too. It's pretty cool though. Uh, another mirror. My bedroom, a bit, a bit messy, but I haven't totally moved in yet. Pretty nice, got a nice bed here. Ari's room, just a bed. Another bathroom, a shower. Not too bad, another mirror. In the master bedroom where our boy Colin is staying. 
Pretty nice TV. It's got his work setup going on here. Pull up bar, another mirror, master bath, another mirror. That's pretty much it. See what we run. Yo, completely forgot to vlog after the run. Didn't end up working out today. Ended up running with Spence. Did about eight miles. Strava right here. Now we're just, you know, grinding out that editing. So I ended up not working out today because between yesterday's run and then even on the run today, I started feeling pretty tired. Um, altitude's definitely catching up to me. We've been here for about a week and you wanna make sure you're definitely focusing on recovery when you're up here at like 5,000, 6,000 feet because that's the part of your training that really gets impacted a lot with the lack of oxygen is muscle repair and all that. So we're making sure to eat well, get our rest, but um, there's only so much you can do before you get the adaptations that altitude gives. So I'm trying to play it smart the first couple weeks. Took a little bit of a down week last week. I only ran 62 miles because um, I'd been going up for a bit. Probably going to try and run between 60 and 65 again this week. Um, just play it smart, prevent injury. If I, if I want to run something fast when we get back, definitely want to play it smart here and not burn out too quick. Um, you know, it's the long game. Uh, there's no point in rushing it if that can uh, negatively impact your running. You want to always play it smart rather than rushing rushing fitness. A little sneak peek of packing special behind the scenes. Okay, I forgot my shoes, big deal. <laughs> <laughs> All right, gonna end the vlog here, guys. Thanks for watching. Leave any more suggestions on what you wanna see uh, in the comments. Um, I got a lot of comments on the last video, so thanks for that. I'm gonna slowly work my way through. I'm not gonna knock out all my content in one video. So uh, stay tuned for uh, some more updates and uh, peace out.